Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You use notes to create little post-it reminders for activities or tasks that are too small to block into your calendar schedule, but that you must remember to do. These notes will go into your notes folder in your Outlook mailbox. Notes are used to remind yourself and others of things that need to be done. You can change the color, size, and font of the note. Notes will appear with the time date stamp of when they were created as well, which can be useful. Notes, like most items, can be deleted, copied, forwarded, and moved. To view the notes folder, you can click the notes button that appears at the bottom of the navigation pane. You could also click the notes icon that appears in the folder list if you have the folder list showing within the navigation pane. The notes folder shows any notes that you have either created or received. You can double click on a note to view it within its own note window, and you can close the window by clicking the X in the upper right corner of the note window. To create a new note, simply click the New Note button that appears in the New Group on the Home tab of the ribbon when viewing the Notes folder in Outlook 2010. If you're using Outlook 2007, select File, New, and Note from the menu bar. That will create a new note into which you can immediately type your information. Now you can close the note when you're finished to simply add it to your notes folder. Once you've created a note, you can also forward it to others as an attachment in an email. Simply right click the note that you want to forward within the notes folder and then select the forward command from the pop-up menu that appears. Then address the email and send it as you normally would. The note will be sent as an attachment. You can change the color of a single note by opening the note and then clicking its note icon in the upper left corner of its title bar. Select the Categorize command from the drop down menu that appears and then choose the color category that you want to use by selecting one from the list of colors in the side menu that appears. You can also set the default properties of notes that you create. You can show or hide the date time stamp that appears by default at the bottom of the note, and you can also change the default color and font that are used for your notes. To set note properties in Outlook 2010, click the File tab in the ribbon, and then click the Options command that appears at the left side of the Backstage view in order to open the Outlook Options dialog box. Then click the Notes and Journal category at the left side of this dialog box. In the Notes Options category, use the Default Color drop-down to choose a default color for your notes. Then use the Default Size drop-down to choose a default note size. You can then click the Font button to open the Font dialog box where you can select a default font to use for your notes. You can then click the OK button to apply it. If you wish to include the date and time when the note was last modified, then ensure that there's a check mark in the Show Date and Time that the note was last modified checkbox. When you're finished, click the OK button in the Outlook Options window to set your new note default properties. To set note properties in Outlook 2007, select Tools and Options from the menu bar to open the Options dialog box. In this dialog box, click the Preferences tab, then click the Note Options button in the lower right corner of this tab to launch the Note Options dialog box. In the Note Options dialog box, you can use the Color drop-down to set the default color of your notes. You can also use the Size drop-down to set the default size of the notes that you create. You can click the Font button to open the Font dialog box where you can select a default font to use for your notes, and then click the OK button to apply it. Then click OK in the Note Options dialog box to set your new note defaults. 
on the Other tab in the Options dialog box in 2007, click the Advanced Options button to launch the Advanced Options dialog box. In the Appearance Options dialog box, you can check or uncheck the checkbox for When Viewing Notes, Show, Time, and Date to add or remove the date time stamp. Then click OK in the Options dialog box to set the default note options in 2007. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.